Framing the American Dream conducted two controlled experiments to allow for apples-to-apples -apples framing method comparisons. In 1995, the project built two identical 2,600-square-foot, two-story houses. The test was then repeated in 2015, when two identical 2,900-square-foot ranch-style houses with walkout basements were framed side-by-side. -side. The only difference between the two homes in both tests was one house was entirely stick-framed, while the other house was framed using structural components, including roof trusses, wall panels, and floor trusses. As these houses were built, the work of each framer was tracked and recorded to measure the time and materials needed to accomplish distinct framing tasks. In this video, we'll look at the differences between site-built stick-framed walls and installed manufactured wall panels. Today, stick framing walls on the job site is the most common method for constructing walls in residential construction. According to a recent member study by the National Association of Home Builders, 90% of all exterior walls are site built. However, framing the American Dream's data clearly indicates that using wall panels saves time and labor costs when compared to stick framing. In the 2015 study, the stick-framed walls took a crew of six framers 29 and a half hours to complete for a total of 177 worker hours. In contrast, a crew of six framers only needed a little over six hours to install the manufactured wall panels, completing the same task in only 36 and a half worker hours. This is a savings of over 140 hours. One of the factors that contributes to the swift installation of wall panels is that framers don't need to spend time constructing rough openings. The more doors and windows a building has, the more labor-intensive it is to build walls on site. Further, as the building codes push for a tighter building envelope, the need to have rough openings built precisely to specification becomes more and more critical. This trend is demanding greater skill, training, and experience for framing crews to ensure their site-built framing passes field inspection. In contrast, wall panels built in a controlled manufacturing environment with the help of computer-aided machinery and a rigorous quality control program ensure rough openings are built correctly every time. On the job site, framing the American Dream's data suggests that installing wall panels completes the task of framing a building's walls in one-fifth the time, requires less framer skill and experience, and ultimately results in a product that is more precise. If you'd like to learn more about the Framing the American Dream project, go to sbcindustry.com forward slash FAD.